In the last 10 years, it's changed. The real turnaround has been since China came on stream. And we have to accept that China can produce at 25% less products that we produce here in the UK. Now you talk about uh, what can the Treasury do. Well, I, I think there's also something else that the industry can do. A bizarre statistic is that Britain is the fourth largest consumer of furniture. I don't know what we do with all this furniture, whether we uh, discard our old furniture more than other countries do, but the fourth largest consumer of furniture. What people want is tight turnarounds. If you go out and you're spending £1,000 on a suite, or you're fitting your office up, you don't want to wait 12 weeks to get that product in your home. You want it next week, or the week after. Now, we've got to look at how we get leaner and meaner in terms of producing products, getting them to the customer, and if there are problems, resolving them. So that you think, OK, I can get this suite cheaper if I buy an import, but if there's a problem with it, or if I have to wait 12 weeks for delivery, I'd rather pay that little bit extra and get it now. People want it now. We are sadly a nation that is becoming very impatient for wanting it now. What we do have is the cutting edge in design. We have the cutting edge in quality. That's why British Bestoke Furniture sells around the world. What we have to do is get that back into our shops and get the, the British public recognising that if it's got a Made in Britain label on it, what you're getting is a higher quality good and it's something that's worth paying that little bit extra for. You've got to remember that the average sort of employer in the British furniture industry employs nine people. We're not ta talking on the whole of large factory numbers, we're talking about small. What's important is that groups like the All Party Group on Furniture is providing the support there. It's important that the regional development agencies are providing the support, that the networks are there to help those small and medium sized companies sustain their companies, sustain their employment and to sustain the quality of the goods that they produce.